August 17, 1991. 9 colon 34 a 247 passenger train departs on time from Wuhan Wuchang railway station the train was made up of 16 sections passenger train number 247 was operating operating duty from Wuchang station to Guangzhou station according to the operating chart the 247 passenger train will arrive at 510 on August 18 the train will arrive at the terminal station Guangzhou station as this train is connected to Wuhan a transportation hub in central China and the other, Guangzhou, one of the destination cities for migrant workers. Therefore, it is always full and hard to get a ticket, the carriage floor is almost too crowded to fit on, so some nimble standing ticket passengers simply climbed onto the luggage rack. The sturdy luggage rack was used as a temporary sleeper, it became a real picture of the overflowing passenger traffic of Chinese railroads, a true reflection of the overflowing passenger flow, and there was a passenger, sat on the luggage rack of the train without permission. And then began to leisurely smoke a cigarette since there was no ashtray on the luggage rack, in order to facilitate, Ning put the finished cigarette but directly thrown in the gap of the luggage rack. August 17, 23 colon 30, the 247 train ran to the Beijing-Guangzhou railroad between Ping and Lekong as the night was late, most of the passengers were in a deep sleep, the carriage was full of snoring sounds, the station in front of the train is Xiaoguan Lekong Station. The expected time of arrival at Lekong Station is August 18, 006 hours, but before arriving at Lekong Station, 247 train will pass through a tunnel. This tunnel is the famous Dayo Mountain Tunnel, the Dayo Tunnel was completed and opened to traffic in December 1989.IT runs from north to south through the Dayo Mountains, it is 14,295 meters long, after the tunnel was opened to traffic. The mileage of the Pingxia to Luchang section was shortened by 15 kilometers. The speed limit for trains has increased from 50 km slash hour, up to 100 km slash h, 23 colon 59 train 247 at 100 km slash h entering the Daishan tunnel. I have to say something here, the next train 247 entered the tunnel on August 17 and it's August 18 when it comes out of the tunnel. The tunnel is dimly lit, it was dark outside the window while most passengers were still asleep, sleeping, suddenly. Smoke began to emanate from a gap in the luggage rack of the carriage soon turned into an open fire, a passenger who was lying on the luggage rack noticed the situation immediately called the train crew on duty in car 17. But by the time the conductor crowded to the place where the fire appeared, the fire had been extinguished, but there was still smoke in the gap. For the sake of safety, the conductor still pulled the emergency brake at 0 0,01, the train then began to slow down slowly and stopped in the Daishan tunnel after the train stopped, the conductor reset the emergency brake, the driver at the head of the engine saw that the train had stopped, so he used the radio to contact the train operator what happened? But the conductor replied that nothing had happened, the driver was also puzzled but since the conductor said it was fine, it should be fine that so the train restarted at 02. The conductor who knew nothing about it, was still checking the source of the smoke with a fire extinguisher, also wondered why the train had started again, and then he hurriedly squeezed his way to the 16th car, pulled down the brake valve again, the train stopped again at zero. Zero eight in the Daishan tunnel, but at that moment, for some unknown reason, the open fire that had been extinguished started to appear again, passengers began to panic. Passengers on the windows struggled to open the windows on both sides, panic jumped out of the car to escape, the panic quickly affected the passengers of car 16, 18, 19 car passengers, everyone jumped down for unknown reasons, as if by magic. A total of three to four hundred people jumped down, at once the scene was in chaos, the staff on the train, five fire extinguishers were used. At 015 to completely extinguish the open fire, hundreds of people jumped from the train, on the up line and down line, the dangerous position between the two lines, the danger was imminent, yet they knew nothing about it. Point zero colon one eight one seven six six cargo train along the upward direction. At a speed of 80 km per hour into the Dejeo tunnel, the sharp siren sound from the upstream tunnel entrance. Those passengers who jumped out of the window from the right side of the carriage, hearing the sound of the train whistle, they panicked and panicked, the tunnel is already blind, in addition, it was late at night, passengers were scurrying around at once. 
the whole tunnel was filled with screams of panic. When the driver of freight train 1766 discovered that there were people on the tracks in front of him was scared out of his wits, instinctively, he immediately took the emergency brake, but by this time, the passengers were already very close, everything will be irreversible. In the end, 1766 freight train in the ear of emergency braking sound hit some of the passengers who had tumbled out of the right side window. The tunnel was filled with the sound of steel and flesh and screams of misery when the freight train 1766 stumbled came to a halt in the Daishan tunnel between the two trains had fallen a piece of people who had either stopped moving or still moving and moaning in pain. The scene was unimaginably tragic in the end, ten people died on the spot. Sixteen people were seriously injured and four people were slightly injured, the accident constituted a mass casualty accident on a passenger train, cause of the accident a train conductor did not verify the cause of the fire, the cause of the fire and the fire point. Made a wrong judgment easy to measure the form, hastily told the driver that nothing happened, so that the driver in the case of unknown reasoning, reopened the car. Interrupting the rescue process of the car on fire delayed the rescue, second passenger Ning kept smoking on the luggage rack, smoking one after another and casually threw the unextinguished cigarette but in the gap also found in the crevice, the paper scraps, wood chips, rags. Small plastic fragments, the unextinguished cigarette ignited these flammable materials. Smoke and open flames appeared after 32 stops, the train staff was busy fighting fires neglected to control the order of the carriage, the train staff was busy fighting the fire and neglected to control the order of the train. Three to four hundred people jumped out of windows in panic and intruded into the upper line of the tunnel eventually hit by the unsuspecting 1766 freight train.